Hey everybody, Fatfish32 here. So today for dinner, I'm making chicken cutlets. Very easy recipe, you come home from work, you're scrounging around, don't even worry about it. So let's get to the ingredients so we can start cooking. So today we are going to need four uh, boneless cutlets, chicken cutlets, and then we're gonna need three bowls of different things, which I have set up right here for you guys to see. So there you go. So you're gonna need two eggs whisked and you do not, you wanna whisk them so you do not see any of the egg white lines in there. So I've got that all scrambled up. Then in this bowl, you're gonna have your flour, your salt and your pepper. One cup of flour, a half a teaspoon salt and pepper, mix that up really well. Then for your third bowl, you're gonna have your breadcrumbs and your Parmesan cheese. So you wanna do one and a half cups of breadcrumb. You can do panko plain or I've done Italian and herb. And then you're gonna put about a cup of grated Parmesan. I just use Parmesan from a bottle, but about one cup, stir that up. Should have a nice aroma of Parmesan cheese in there. You want one medium lemon. You're gonna need two tablespoons of olive oil. And then your chicken cutlets. So first you wanna take some plastic wrap on your counter, any flat surface. You wanna take a rolling pin or any kind of malice that you have, maybe a meat malice. Put one strip of uh, wrap on the counter. Then you're gonna put your four chicken cutlets on there. You're gonna put another thing of plastic wrap on top and you're gonna pound those down to one fourth inch thick. And then you're gonna cut them horizontally so each one is then two cutlets. So I'll show you what that looks like right here. I've already got mine pounded down to a four inch thick. Okay. So I'm gonna cut those horizontally and then we're gonna get our uh, cast iron skillet with the two tablespoons of olive oil and start heating that up so we can make our Parmesan crusted chicken cutlets. Okay guys, so I cut my cutlets into halves horizontally. So now they're two in each cutlet. There we go. I've got my cast iron skillet on the stove. I put my two tablespoons of olive oil and started heating that up on medium high heat. Turn it down just a little bit after it gets hot, not too much. Right. I decided to go with my smaller cast iron skillet. I'm just gonna do two cutlets at a time. I don't wanna overcrowd the pan or anything. I want them to cook well. So what you're gonna do, starting with each cutlet, you're gonna take one, you're gonna dredge it through the flour mixture. Then you're gonna put it in the egg. Then you're gonna put it in your breadcrumbs, kind of press them in to make sure those breadcrumbs stick. Then you're gonna put it in your pan and cook them on each side four to five minutes. So let's see what that looks like, right? All right, taking my first cutlet. So we're gonna put that right in the flour, like that. All right, shake off any excess, and then let's put it in the egg. The lemon, you can just cut into wedges. You're gonna serve it with the chicken cutlets after, so it's not a big deal if you haven't done anything with it. All right. We got it in our breadcrumb mixture. Just make sure to pat that so all the breadcrumbs stick. And then pop it in there. Let's do one more. So remember, flour first. Make sure to get the flour all over. Shake off any excess, then put it into the egg. And then right into the breadcrumbs. Pat that, make sure all of it gets breaded, make sure the breadcrumbs are sticking, and put that right into your pan. Just like that. Give you guys a little clearer look there. Okay. And then you just wanna cook them, like I said, on four to five minutes on each side. When they're done, just take them out, put them on a plate with a paper towel so they can drain a little bit, all the oil and fat and stuff and then serve it with whatever you like. Okay, so the first set of two cutlets are done and I've got two more going in the pan. And then I'll show you what they came out like. And there they are. Put it in the light so you guys can see a little better. So I hope you guys enjoyed this recipe for Parmesan crusted chicken cutlets. Hope your family enjoys it. I hope it you know, took a little bit of time out of your day so that you didn't have to struggle with dinner. And thanks for following. Like, share, comment, you guys. Thanks for all the support. Remember to follow me on Instagram, Fatfish32, Facebook, Fat Topics. 
I've got two boards on Pinterest. Also, check out my husband's uh, title clothing. His board is up on my Pinterest as well. Um, and also, Fat Topics or Fat Girl in the Kitchen on my IGTV. Don't forget to check that out either. Have a great night, everybody.